How's it going today everyone? Brandon here with Fishy15.com and in this video I'm going to be giving you guys updates on where the state of the iOS 6 and iPhone 5 jailbreak is at this point in time. Yes, I am sick. I'm actually very sick. I've had a fever and stuff the past few days, but I will always be here to make jailbreak videos for you guys. Go ahead and show me support and subscribe to my videos and hit the like button if you guys like this video. So, you know, a lot of us jailbreakers out there are kind of losing hope. Well, we were losing hope that no more jailbreaks were going to be developed. It was a rumor a while ago that jailbreakers um, and the actual hackers would had stopped making jailbreaks and they weren't doing it anymore and there was no other way to make jailbreaks. A ton of people actually started believing that and you know, uh, because iOS 6 has been up for a long time, there's still no untethered jailbreak. I kind of started thinking that maybe the jailbreaks have stopped being published for good. But one of the actual known and one of the better respected developers in the community, Planet Being on Twitter, actually gave us a little update to get our hopes up a little bit, and this is what he said. Yeah, I'm not really sure what all the doom and gloom is about. The fact is, I have an untethered iOS 6.0.2 jailbreak running on my iPhone 5 right now. The reasons it's not released are because, one, Releasing it would burn an exploit we want to save for ourselves so we can always get in and look at new firmwares and help jailbreak in the future. And two, iOS 6.1 is coming very soon and will likely break a small part of it anyways. There's no point in sacrificing the many bugs it won't break. And he also says, anyway, where there are four plus bugs that it took to get this to work, there's got to be one or two more so while jailbreaking is getting harder, reports of its death are highly exaggerated. This is not stuff I want to say over Twitter with 140 characters because I'm afraid of starting some sort of riot. But I li like the smaller Reddit jailbreak community more. And then he puts a little winky face. So that gives me and hopefully all of you guys a ton of hope that there will soon be an iOS 6 jailbreak. I know there are jailbreaks already, but they're uh, tethered jailbreaks, which means you have to like boot it up with the computer. And what we're looking for is an untethered jailbreak. And for iPhone 5, the iPad mini, the iPad 4, the iPod Touch 5th generation, just all these iOS 6 devices. If you guys have been a jailbreaker for a long time, you know, come a little more quickly than they have with the past few jailbreaks. So this might make some of you guys kind of upset and kind of angry that he's not releasing it, but you guys should not be upset whatsoever. This is a good sign, uh, Planet Bank told us. He actually gave us a heads up that there is a jailbreak in the process of being develop. All we have to do is just sit and wait. And what we need to do as a community is just help him. Don't don't give him those stupid tweets like hating on him and stuff for not developing fast enough, not releasing his jailbreak or anything like that. Give him positive and those kind of good tweets and messages and emails and stuff like that. I'm sure they would love those and that would make them work a little faster than giving them hateful tweets and emails and I hate you and you suck and that kind of stuff. So basically this is it for the video guys. I'm just giving you guys a heads up on the state of the jailbreak. This is my second episode in this series. I will definitely continue if that's what you guys want. Leave me some feedback in the comments below. And again, be sure to subscribe above. Hit the like button if you like this video. And I'll catch you guys later. Peace.